with Sam. If you're new here, welcome. My name is Samantha, Sam for short. And in today's video, we are doing another small business review. I'm super excited about today's review because we're reviewing a custom-made unit from a small black-owned business. And I'm super excited. This queen reached out to me and offered to make me a free custom-made unit in exchange for an honest review here on my YouTube channel. After seeing that video of me being super frustrated about a wig that I purchased from West Kids Hair not you know completely fitting my head so she reached out to me and offered to make me one that will hopefully fit in exchange for a review here on my channel so i'm super excited about today's video as you can see it turned out great um but before we get into all that go ahead and follow my instagram page assumption underscore my business page as well assumption cosmetics go ahead and click that subscribe button if you have not already and we're gonna hop straight into the video so to start this video off as always the first thing i like to do is go to the person's website or instagram page um but before i get into that i do want to mention that she reached out to me on december 17 2020 and asked to make me a custom unit in exchange for an honest review here on my youtube channel and i said sure of course so the circumference of my head is about 24 inches yes i have a super large head um the average size i believe is like 22.5 or something like that maybe even 22 and i have 24. so that's why it's very difficult for me to find wigs that actually fit because i truly do have a large head but i'm learning to embrace it it is super frustrating when i can't find good quality affordable wigs that actually fit my head also asked for the measurements from the front of my head to the nape of my head and that was 14 inches I ended up receiving the wig on Tuesday, February 9th. I wanted to go to her Instagram. Her Instagram name is Maija.B. And she has um, a few photos, well actually a lot of photos of her hair, what kind of hair she sells. And photos of the wig on her, client photos. I believe she does not have a website, so if you want to order from her, you would have to DM her on her Instagram page. I will be sure to link it down below in the description box as well as included in the video. I do want to share a few details with you all that she sent me. So just in case you are wanting to order from her, she offers 100% virgin hair. We sell pre-made wigs. They are between 150 and 180 density. Custom made units are made with three bundles and a closure or frontal, which is what I got. She said um, you can order through her on her Instagram page at myja.b. Uh, custom units take seven to 14 days to complete. She's also a black owned business out of Brooklyn, New York, and she started in February of 2020 okay 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 i love to see it we love to see it um but before i get into installing this wig i do want to mention that i am not a pro with this this is something that i want to practice more on because like i said it's very hard for me to find really good wigs that would actually fit and because i have not come across too many um, I have not had the time to actually practice with it and sit down and install it. So let's get into actually opening this package. So this is what the wig came in. And so it came in a bag inside of a bag. This is what the bag looks like. Let's see what it says. In the vast sea, don't overlook the little fish. Shop small. That's cute. That's really cute. Although, don't just spell wrong, but this is still cute. I like this. I love the details on here, like the, the island and the sea and the flowers. I like that. That's so cute. I already got my ball cap on, as you can see. And this is how you know my hair is big. The ball cap does not even fit over all of my edges. <laughs> Okay, wow, so she sent me some goodies. Okay, so, y'all, here's the wig. Like I said, I'm super, I know I'm doing a lot of talking. I don't care, because you're still gonna watch it. But I'm super excited to install this unit, because like I said, I, I don't think I've ever come across a wig that completely fits. So I'm really hoping this wig fits. I love that she put it in this plastic protective bag. As you, you know, it looks like I bought it from the store or from like a beauty supply store. 
Also, she included some more goodies in here. She did tell me she included an elastic band just in case I wanted to attach it to the wig. Thank you, Queen. Even though I know nothing about that, but we'll see, we'll see. And this also came in the bag as well. It looks like some, wait, let's see. So this is what came in that little wrap as well as a card. So let's get into this first. So, oh, hand sanitizer. She sent me some hand sanitizer, um, some conditioner. I'm guessing for the wig, conditioner, uh, some disinfectant wipes, and shampoo from the brand, what brand this is? Pure Beauty, but from this brand. So thoughtful of you, Queen. Thank you so much. We definitely need like hand sanitizer and disinfectant wipes in these times to look at the card thanks you're so cool on the front and it says hey sam finally the goods are here we like to thank you for giving us a try we hope you love your unit most of all we are happy to be a part of your sleigh be safe stay beautiful spread love my B. So she did give me her email, her phone number, her IG, and her office hours, um, just in case I need to contact her. Um, but there's the card. This really made my day. I love when you guys write me like sweet notes because I don't know, it makes me, it makes me love what I do. And it makes me really happy to know that what I'm doing is touching you all. And I, I really do like that. That really makes my day. She did also say that hair can be dyed to any color, but it comes in the natural color. We're going to open it. So the hair smells like it's been washed. It does not have a strong smell. It just smells like she washed it, which is great. You always want to wash your hair before you sit it out. Oh, this is a long wig, y'all. She sent me a long one. Okay, sis, okay. I want to see if this bad boy fits, so. wig fits i will say that even though it does not cover all of my edges this is the best that a wig has ever fit my head the wig like i said even though it does not cover like my edges this is the best that a wig has ever comfortably fit and i'm super impressed like you can't even see my edges anyway so i, I don't even care about that I, I just like the fact that the wig fits like <laughs> So let's take this wig off. Uh, and I, oh, <laughs> it's a closure wig, as you can tell. And this is what the inside of the cap looks like. So I can tell that she bleached these knots because some of the bleach actually got on the roots. which can easily be corrected with mascara or hair dye. I don't have mas I mean, I don't have hair dye, so I may end up using mascara, which is not a big deal to me. So I think what I'm going to do is go ahead and wash this wig again. Oh, I will also say that some pieces of hair are shorter than others, like right here. Not really sure why, not really sure what's going on there. And also right here, but I'm probably just gonna tame that away. I wish I had like some of that uh, edge tamer, wax stick, whatever they call it. Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and rewash this wig. Even though I can already tell she washed it because like you can, like I said, you can smell like the conditioner or whatever on it. Um, but I'm gonna go ahead and rewash it again, blow dry it, and I'll be back. So I just got done washing the wig. I used the conditioner and shampoo that she sent me with the wig, which actually smells really good, by the way. So now I'm just going to blow dry it. I'm placing it on my mannequin head. I will say that this hair is very soft. <laughs> 
Yeah, so soft and so silky. I love it. I can tell that it's good quality hair. It does not resemble cheap or trash hair at all. And so I'm combing through the wig right now and there's literally no shedding. I think only maybe one strand of hair has come out since I opened the package. So that's a good sign. That's a really good sign. I cannot stand a wig that sheds like a dog. I just cannot. I will also say that I wish the tracks were a little bit closer to the actual band like not on the band but i do wish the tracks were a little bit closer that way you know it would be not full right here but i wouldn't have to try to hide that as much i guess but other than that i can really tell this is some good quality hair it did already come with a middle part, which is fine with me. I normally wear middle parts anyway. Not done blow drying this hair yet. I have probably been blow drying for the last 20 minutes now, but this is some long hair. But I stopped to say that this is really some gorgeous hair. Like, look at that. And the shading is very minimal. Not a lot at all compared to what I'm used to. So that is a plus for me. So it's safe to say I can go a little bit past my actual hairline because my forehead is big, y'all. And I kind of want to conceal as much of that as possible. But now I'll go down to my eyebrows. We ain't doing that. I definitely could go glueless if I wanted to, but I feel like it would just move if I did. So I'm going to put some got to be spray glue on it. Or I may go ahead and actually glue it down. I don't know yet. I don't know yet. Yeah, I'm just brainstorming. So I'm going to pull it down as much as I can. Oh, let's see if it goes to my ears. It went to my ears. Barely. Okay. Then my got to be spray. It's blending in really well with my skin.
but I'm absolutely in love with this hair. Let me stop and say I salute those of you who are beauty gurus, those of you who film wig reviews for a living because this stuff is not easy, at least not for me. This hair is really soft, long, like y'all. This has to be like 24 inches. I love this wig y'all. I'm so in love with it. This hair is really good quality hair. Like I can tell just by running my fingers through it, when I blow dried it, when I washed it, this is really good quality hair. I really do like this wig, I love it. This is the most comfortable my hair has felt in the wig. And I love the fact that the wig was big enough for the closure to come down a little further than my actual hairline. So I love that. Okay guys, so this is the finished look. Um, I do want to give my final thoughts and opinion about the hair. So guys, I really struggle applying this wig, not because of the hair itself. The wig itself was actually really fine. Probably the best one I've received thus far. Um, it's just the glue. I don't like that ghost bind glue. I really struggle with that glue. So onto the hair, I really do love this hair. This is probably some of the best hair that I've received. It's so soft, so silky. I washed it with no problem, shampooed it, conditioned it with no problem, blow dried it. I just got finished one curling it with no problem. The shedding is very minimum compared to wigs that I've received in the past, which I'm super happy about because I cannot stand wigs that shed so bad. Like I hate it so much. So shedding with this wig is very minimum. Um, also, I love how the lace, like I won't say completely melted into my skin. I love how the lace closely resembles my skin. Like, yes, yes ma'am, I love that. And this is actually Swiss lace. She does use HD lace and transparent lace, but she said that she did not want me to wait any longer for it to come in. So she just used the Swiss lace and I'm totally okay with that because my lash coming out. And I'm totally okay with that because I had no problem like really just melting this into my skin. It was just more so the glue. 
Um, but that could be because I'm not, you know, I'm not experienced with it. But I'm gonna keep practicing, of course. But I really love how this wig turned out. I will say one thing that I've noticed with this wig is that um, it does have short pieces throughout it. I'm not sure what's that about. It looked like maybe they've been cut, but that's not a big deal. I'll just go ahead and yank them out because they don't want it to go with the flow most of the time. So I just go ahead and yank those out. Even though my sideburns are left out a little bit, I am okay with that because the hair does cover it. And also this wig is so comfortable. Now she did send me an elastic band to attach to the wig, which I probably should have done to maybe give it a little bit more stretch so that my sideburns won't be out. But honestly, this is the best that a wig has ever fit my head. So I didn't want to go through the trouble of sewing on an elastic band just to make it, you know, cover my sideburns because you really can't even see my sideburns with my hair like this. Also, this wig is completely comfortable, so I didn't really feel the need to go in and attach the elastic band. Now, if this wig was much smaller, I probably would have went in and attached the elastic band, but I don't need to tighten it. I don't need to stretch it anymore because to me, it fits just fine. Um, I'm totally satisfied with this wig it's so gorgeous it's so beautiful i love it i really do love this wig uh, i'm going to be sure to list her details down below in the description box again thank you so much queen for reaching out to me and asking me to review this wig uh it was a pleasure i wish you much much success with your business i see so much potential like i am so impressed with this wig. I can honestly say I like it better than wigs I've received from bigger companies. Small businesses care so much more about their clients, their customers. They care so much about the quality of their hair and they they care, you know, they care to me, in my opinion, more than bigger companies care about their clients or their customers. Love is definitely shown through this wig. I really do appreciate it. Um, guys, be sure to check her out if you want to order a wig for your big head. <laughs> um, I'm sure she will deliver, okay? So my main concern with receiving this wig was that the closure would act as a closure and it did. I was able to even bring the closure a little bit past my hairline. So that is a major plus to me. But overall guys, I really do like this wig. I am so satisfied. I cannot wait to upload this video. If you want me to review products from your business, be sure to shoot me an email at my email address listed down below in my description box. Go ahead and like this video if you liked it and go ahead and click the subscribe button if you're not already subscribed. And I will see you guys in my next video.